from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News, live at the Minnesota State Fair. Hi, I'm Andrew with your WCCO newscast, live from the State Fair. We want to begin today at the Haunted House, where WCCO anchors Frank and Chris have gone in but have not made it out. Witnesses tell us the two looked ready for just about anything as they went through the front door, but that was four hours ago. A search party has been sent in. They heard Frank and Chris screaming, but have not been able to find them. A mummy on the second floor tells WCCO he saw a couple, the couple an hour, about an hour ago, but the pair jumped, screamed, and ran out before he could grab them. We will continue to follow the search and let you know what happens. But right now, let's get a look at the weather and traffic. Thanks. I'm Duff with your weather and traffic. It's a beautiful day here at the State Fair, and we're told officials are expecting record numbers of people on the streets. We're seeing some backups on Judson Avenue near the Miracle of Birth Center, where Ashley the cow is expected to give birth at any moment. Things are getting congested on Cooper Street, right outside the Lumberjack Show. There's also some reports of a family weaving in and out of traffic. It turns out they couldn't wait to try the new Bacon Fluffer Nutter. As for this beautiful stretch of weather, we're having it is expected to last all week. Back to you. We want to update you now on our top story. Frank and Chris have been found. The pair were hiding behind a coffin on the third floor of the haunted house. They are thirsty and a little shaken but are expected to be okay. That's all we have time for today. I'm Andrew. And I'm Duff. Thank you for watching WCCO News at the Fair. This has been a WCCO4 News Update from the Minnesota State Fair. Thanks for watching.